So go into Google and search up the image you want. Make sure it's a PNG. If you have a photo that isn't a PNG, you can watch my other tutorial on how to turn it into a PNG. So once you have your photo, you have to open up Photoshop. I am using Photoshop, Photoshop CC in this video. Once you open up Photoshop, go to File and click New. Set the width and height to 0.5. If you want a bigger cursor, then set the width and height to 1. Now after this, go into File and then Place and choose the photo you want. Now you can resize it and do whatever you want with it. So once you're finished that, click the check mark on the right. And then you have to go to your Paint tool and paint the cur cursor part, just like in the video. Just like that. Make sure your paintbrush is the size of three or less in order to do this. So now you're just going to save it as a PNG and you can title it whatever you want. So I titled my mango cursor. <laughs> so. Now you're going to go on to a website called TinyPic and upload your photo onto it. So type in the CAPTCHA. And then you're going to copy the direct link for layouts code. Now you're going to go onto your blog and click customize and edit HTML. Now scroll all the way down to the bottom of your code and paste in the code. I've put in the description. In the brackets, paste your image code, which was the code you copied at TinyPic. Click update preview and now you have a custom made cursor.